What is up guys, me luck here, and today we're back in action playing the forest, and uh, today we're going to be doing some pretty awesome stuff, so, uh, <laughs> if you guys enjoyed, make sure to go ahead and click that like button, it'd be freaking amazing, and I love you guys forever, so what I think we're going to be doing today is, uh, let, let me open up this guy, I was thinking maybe we can start planning out our base, I mean, we have a little home here, and it's decently safe, but I was thinking we might be able to plant some walls around here. That way I could like maybe go underneath the treehouse and, uh, you know, cook some food and do all that kind of stuff. And maybe we'll even do a gazebo and stuff. I was thinking that might be kind of a cool idea. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, start planting some stuff out. What I had decided was let's uh, let's go over here. So we have the treehouse. Uh, we have some of this stuff. Uh, let's make, should we make defensive walls? Let's see. I kind of want to try the defensive spikes out as well. That might be kind of cool. Um, I wonder if it does damage. I mean, I'm assuming since it says defensive spike, it does damage. But it might not necessarily do damage. So should we make walls or should we do defensive walls? We might just do plain walls and then maybe do defensive walls later. I don't know, or maybe we should just start straight out with defensive walls. So if I... Let's let's come over here. So are we have we want to straighten this out to be about the same as this guy right here, but about the same angle or so. Is this about the same angle? Yeah, I think it is. Um, if we let's uh, let's take a look at this real quick. Yeah, that's about the same. Okay, so I think is this is this about the same? Yeah, that's about the same. Okay, okay. So let's just start uh, planning this out. We want to maybe do a little bit of this action. Oh dang it. Um defensive wall will this lock oh no I don't want it to lock in right there yeah there we go that's where I want to lock lock in at so we got two walls right here now how wide do you think we should make it probably maybe like that something like that maybe we'll do like a three by three all the way around or maybe so that's about the middle maybe we'll do a five by five yeah let's yeah let's do a five by five I think that would be kind of cool defensive wall um, are you going to lock in, man? There we go. Um, so, oh, oh, lag, lag, lag. <laughs> and then, uh, so we're, we're going to need to cut down this tray. I'd also like to maybe go get the, the modern axe today, uh, in the main village or so. But, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll worry about this first. So this is going to require a lot of logs. We already need 30 logs. Um, maybe we'll just do the back wall for now. Oh, no, we might as well just go ahead and plant it all out. So we'll do a defensive wall, and we'll cut it straight across right here. There we go. Yeah, hopefully it all lines up, and hopefully it all looks nice. Um, that's one thing that kind of sucks is sometimes like it doesn't line up very well, and it looks kind of crummy. Um, but so that's three. And then we want um, four, and then five. Yeah, something like that. Oh yeah, that's plenty of room. I was thinking we could do, do like a door right here in the front. Or maybe maybe we should do a door in the back. I'm not sure. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. So, we'll say uh, L. Um, so, I forget how to open the, the book straight up like this. Is it just L? No, it's not L. Is it P? No. No? Okay. <laughs> There's a way. I, I used to know how to do it. I just can't remember anymore. I'll look in the controls later. So that's two. Um, uh, th three. Then we got four. And then one more. Yeah. Yeah, this will definitely be way big enough. This will definitely be big enough. So right now we need about 90 logs. Yeah, we need six logs. That's 90 logs. Holy balls, that's a lot of logs. Uh, but I think the space is definitely big enough. We have a fire right here, and then we'll be able to maybe put two walls right here with a door in the center. Okay, yeah, that'll be fine. What do you Get out of the way, coons, you stupid dirty animals. You dirty animals. Uh, do we have any food on us? Yeah, we have some foods. We have some circuit board. We have some teeth. I kind of want to try out this uh, axe thing. So if we do tree sap. Combine. Um, so if I... So can I just do this forever? Like, does this just work forever? 
I mean, I want to know how much damage this actually adds or, you know, like, does it make cutting down stuff faster or... I'm not sure. This is really weird. Okay, well, maybe that didn't do anything. Um, <laughs> maybe that didn't do anything. I, I feel like it's supposed to, like, make it maybe swing faster or do more damage. I'm not sure. Um, but let's travel through the woods here, and I'll probably get some of those logs and stuff done off camera. Let's travel through the woods, and then I want to find the main village, probably. I might go ahead and cut it here until we, you know, come across the main village. But I definitely want to get the modern axe. Also, I want to maybe mark out a few caves. That way we kind of have, like, places to go to. And we know, hey, come here, Bambi. Come here, Bambi. Ah. Ah, stupid Bambi. I don't like you anyways, Bambi. Uh, let's let's go ahead and eat some food. Yeah. Let's get some of that energy back, son. I might as well collect a few sticks on the way. Oh, looks like we're completely filled up on sticks. Or, I mean, uh, rocks. Wait. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here, bros. I don't want none of your stuff. I don't see them, but they're probably stalking me in the treetops or something. <laughs> Stupid cannibals. What are you guys doing? Stupid butin cannibals. Why can't you just be civilized like the rest of nature? Even though nature isn't civilized. Damn, nature, you scary. You scary, nature. <laughs> um, okay, so, uh, main village. I'm trying to think. So there's the plane over there. And I, the main village isn't this way, I don't think. I'm trying to remember. It's hard to remember where stuff is. Uh, is there a cave here? Oh, there is a cave. Okay, sick. Okay, so I actually think this is the main cave. Um, like, from the beginning. Uh, let's see. Fire. Uh, let's just step two. Toxic. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Um... Stick marker. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we marked the cave. Sick. And uh, that's what today might be. We might just go ahead and mark out a bunch of... Um, okay. Well, this is weird. Uh, also, I killed... Uh, when I killed one of those guys, I picked up their thing. Yeah, the big... The, the skull basher thing. That thing's kind of cool. Eh. Okay, sick. Uh, do I have tree sap left? Yeah, I got plenty of tree sap left. Just curious. Yeah, we might just go ahead and mark out a few locations today. So there's the plane down there. Our home's over there. There's the cave. Uh, we might try to mark out a few other caves and the main village. And like I said before, it'd be kind of cool if you do different markers. Like I could do like um, little weird houses or something like to mark all the villages. And maybe little cave symbols to mark out all the caves. Maybe a plane sig signal uh, uh, symbol to mark out like where the plane is and stuff. I think they should add some kind of marker stuff like that. It'd be pretty sweet. Okay, so let's just travel through the woods until we find some stuff. Yeah, give me, come here, stick. Oh, I don't have any room for you, stick. Oh, oh, there's some, there's some creatures around. I sense them with my bat scent, my spidey sense. My spidey sense is never wrong. Hmm. <laughs> These woods freak me out. I'm like, no. Okay, so I think we're we're reaching something. Oh, there's the. This is definitely not the right way. I don't think. Wait, no, 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 no. Okay, so that's that's the thing. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pause it until I find something. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, so I found a little mini village. Uh, let's kill this guy. Ah, yeah. Get. Oh, oh it's a starving cannibal. Yeah, get wrecked. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, oh, yes, yeah, come on. Come on. Okay, he's dead. He's for sure dead. Okay, so let's grab all the loot here. Um. <laughs> no. No. Um. Okay, looks like there's, like, nothing here. Well, that's disappointing. Um. Oh, wait, no, there's some rope. There's some rope. I also found another little village that I got some more rope in. So we have plenty of rope. We can make a bow. I forget how to make a bow, though. I said I was going to look it up, but... I Come here. Yeah. 
Ah, oh, come here, lizard. Yeah, we need your skin, man. I'm sorry I have to murder you and your family. Um, let's go ahead and equip some of this lizard skin. There we go. I hate the creepy music. Stop playing creepy music. <laughs> uh, hopefully they'll just think one of their cannibal friends, uh, murdered their, uh, the friend. Because it wasn't me. It definitely wasn't me. I did not murder their friend. It was not me. Okay, so, we found that. I, I can't find the main village for some reason. I don't know where it's at. Um, let me, let me get up here. Maybe, maybe, I, I have a feeling like it's around here somewhere, though. What's this little hillside area here? Look at the sun. The sun looks so, uh, so pretty right here. Oh, yeah, give me some of that. I need some of those berries. Give me some of those berries. Yeah, give me all those berries. I need, we need to find, like, knife blades and attach knife blades to this axe or something. That'd be pretty sick. <laughs> Make, like, a purely, purely, uh, death weapon. Okay, so there's a sacred treat. Um, okay, well, I guess, I guess I'll be right back again, guys. Okay, so I decided to come back, had to come back to sleep and make it daytime and that kind of stuff. Um, I went ahead and finished the wall here. I just gotta, obviously, get, like... <laughs> 110 uh, logs it looks like so it says 0 out of 11 so I think it's 110 uh, but I did notice one thing in the guide here there's a bonfire now um, which is really cool I was thinking maybe we could make one maybe make one like right beside the lake here and supposedly you can see it from really far away um, so this needs 10 sticks and 5 logs so yeah that's just like one tall tree so let's go ahead and cut this tree down and uh See what this thing looks like. I'm really, I'm kind of, this is kind of uh, exciting. I've never seen the bonfire before. So maybe it was, uh, oh, two tree sap collected. Okay. I'm excited about when they add leather in and tanning and all that kind of stuff. I think it's going to be kind of cool once, like, the crafting system and everything else is a little bit more deeply involved. Make this game last a little bit longer. Oh, okay. It's falling the right way. Okay. There we go. Uh, there we go. Okay, sick. I'm excited about this bonfire. Maybe we'll make maybe we'll make one like in the big main camp and uh, that kind of stuff. Is there another log here somewhere? Hmm. Okay. Well, is there th is there another log? Please tell me there's another log somewhere. It's kind of hard to see with all this white everywhere. Uh doesn't look like there's a fifth log unless I just missed it, which could be a possibility. Uh, okay, well, let's cut down this tree that's inside of our thing right here. What are you doing, man? There we go. There we go. Let's cut down this tree, baby. And we'll have a few logs left over, so that'll be fine. Uh, we just need one log, so maybe we'll just go ahead and finish one of these walls real quick. Eh, come on. Okay, there we go. There's the bonfire. Uh, hopefully it just stays a permanent thing. So, like, if we light... Well, we'll wait till nighttime to light it. I think it would be kind of cool when, uh, to see it when it's nighttime. Uh, we'll just go ahead and do one more of these. Um, stupid rock. It would be kind of cool if you could build, like, cobble walls or something. Uh, you know, let's just go ahead and light it. I think this would be cool. Uh, let's... Can I cook food on it? No, it doesn't look like it. <laughs> okay, well, uh, that's that's cool. Um, let's let's start this fire and fix some food. Hey, Bambi, you want some lizard meat, Bambi? Okay, that's cooking. Oh, yeah, Bambi, get murdered, get wrecked. You thought you were my friend, but you weren't. Uh, let's make some Molotovs. Yeah. Yeah. 
Let's make some of these Molotovs. Yeah, these are going to be really useful. Yeah. <laughs> I really want to Molotov some villagers before this, uh, or villagers balls, some mutants before this episode is over. Um, yeah, maybe we'll do that. Okay, so I'm going to pause it one last time. We're going to go find the main village. I'm going to Molotov some of these fools' faces off. Okay, well, I searched around. I couldn't find it. I did mark out another cave, though. But what I figured what we could do is something that, oh, look at this, wooden paths. What is that? Oh, that's cool. Oh, so you can just... Oh, it, like, sinks into the ground stuff as well. Can you, like, uh... Uh, no, that doesn't work out too well. Um, okay, anyways, I want to make a... Oh, by the way, I figured out it's B. So, uh, just to open up the book. Um, so we have a new, uh, uh, gazebo. Um, let's see, what else do we have? A rabbit cage, ragged, a rabbit trap. Hmm. A drying rack. A houseboat. I want to make, um, let's see, let's go back here. Something to make getting logs easier. Yeah, log sled. There we go. This is what I want. A log sled. And I think you can just pull it around. Yeah, so it needs 16 sticks. Let's go ahead and uh, get some of these guys. And I'm pretty sure you just drag it around and it carries logs. And it makes like getting logs and stuff a lot easier. Which is pretty cool. I think it's a pretty cool idea. Uh, let's see. Let me get some sticks here. Uh, where are you, sticks? Where are you, be sticks? <laughs> In comments, has passed 14 sticks. <laughs> oh my gosh, where are you at, sticks? I know you're here somewhere. You're just hiding from me, aren't you? You're ashamed of what happened last night. <laughs> Stupid rabbit. There we go. Give me all your sticks, son. Okay, so let's finish up this log sled. I'm going to chop down a few trees and see how many logs this guy can actually hold. And uh, if it's going to make my life any easier. Um, so... Oh, you just... <laughs> you just push it. Uh... Huh. Okay, so you just push it, eh? Uh, let's chop down a tree and test it out. Eh, come on, babe. There we go. Yeah, let's get this tree. I'm gonna, I'm owning this tree right now. This tree belongs to me. Okay, so it holds two. Let's see, how many does it hold total? Okay, so it holds four. Does it hold any more than that? Let's see. Let's try it out. Let's see how many it can hold total. And, uh, yeah, this might make my life a lot easier. You just drag it around, cut trees, and then you just push it back. Um, it's kind of weird that you don't, like, drag it with a rope or something. I feel like that would be much better. You take a rope, put it in your hand, and, like, right-click it, kind of like Minecraft with a horse and saddle or something. There we go. What the balls? There we go. Okay. So it can hold four for sure. Oh, so it can hold that many. Oh, let's push this guy around. Does it get heavier as like the logs are in it? No, it doesn't look like it's that bad. Hmm. God forbid it gets stuck or something though, or, or like goes all the way down into like the water. That'd be funny. Oh, it looks like it can hold seven. Okay. Uh, that's still pretty good. Like, I mean, it's better than, um, there we go. Okay, so we have a bunch of logs. Let's go ahead and push this guy back and maybe finish a couple segments of the wall. And uh, that'll be pretty sick. Ah. <laughs> ah. So it looks like I can hold nine total logs. Ah. And the steering this thing is really weird. Ah. You shall be steered, young sir. <laughs> uh, let's let's just go ahead and uh, I want to take a sweet picture. There we go. Uh Oh, uh, there we go. Let's, uh, E. Uh, 
Okay, well, uh, we finished uh, a couple a couple wall segments here, so that's good. Um, what I think I'm going to do is I'm probably going to go ahead and call it here. And uh, maybe next time I want to go in a cave adventure. So we made a bunch of Molotovs, so maybe we'll use the Molotovs in the cave. And we'll go on a pure cave adventure uh, next time and try to stay alive. It'll be cool. No, dear body. No. <laughs> okay, well, I love you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time.